Hey, welcome to Neversink Farms Tomato House. I want to talk about the infrastructure for trellising tomatoes in a hook and wicket system. In a hook and wicket system, you only need EMT. Uh, you can use wire, but uh, wire is much harder to set up. You have to anchor it and things like that. So on a hook and wicket system, I, I recommend the EMT, which just lays on top of the trusses. Any, any hook system can go on the EMT. Right, they're just going to lay right on top of it, right? As well as the uh, the clipper hook, right? They're just laying here. Now, it, the EMT won't work in a uh, lower and lean system because in a lean system, right, they could slip. You see, you're going to need a wire, right? Because at that angle, they just don't work very well. Okay, and the pipe, whole piping can slide. Right, so if they do catch, right, the piping itself could move. So you need a wire system where you can use the, uh, it's called a gripple, where you're putting two wires into the gripple and then you use something to tighten it up. But then you have to put in infrastructure to hold your walls in place. And that gets quite complicated. And that's something I do because I use the hook and wicket. Um, and that's in another video if you want to know about the hook and wicket and how to use that. But the trellising infrastructure can be just EMT, which is very cheap. Get it, you know, Home Depot, Lowe's, your electrical supply. Um, and they last for many, many, I've had these for oof, maybe 15 years. And there's no difference and they, and they work really, really great. All right, so thanks for watching and until next time.